what would that look like on a daily basis? Will it mean that we, let's say we take an interface like Microsoft Teams, you know, let's take, take your role right now. Will it be a case of you really sitting in front of a screen that is popping up, let's say cards, like in Teams, you know how you get an information card pop up and perhaps we'll have cues of those that we need to respond to. And that's a, an agent has done something and it needs that kind of human in the loop to click and on to the next thing that you're just, you know, you're going to have just the bit that needs that human input. And of course, my question then is how long till the validation of correctors, it's at 99.999% that they go, well, we don't need that to be fed to a human anymore. We've got that one under control. So I think, you know, is it going to be that as it then basically we're going to be the master conductor of routing um, scenarios that fit outside the norm because all the routing of all approved scenarios inside an organization, I think will work automatically. A couple of weeks ago, I did a podcast on business process, uh, BPM, business process management. And I think business process management is really critical in this because it is how your company carries out and does processes. And in more traditional companies, that is highly documented. There's ISO standards that your organization comply with to show it has the rigor around that, to show that customers are supported in a rigorous way, meaning that the, the way we do it is, is documented, we have flags in place to check that it's been done. The definition of done has been achieved. So I'm wondering, will our roles involve more of us being involved in business process optimization when we're feeding in or delegating to a new digital worker, the looking at our process and let's say needing it to be updated. And then I can see in time. And when we look into process mining and these tools that have been around for a while, but if we look at the advancements of them, you know, I can imagine AI, there's going to be an AI that's role inside the organization is process optimization, right? That's going to look for going, how can I improve the process? And then perhaps in real time, if it gets enough validating factors to upgrade a process in real time. So you get these processes becoming super efficient. And then I go, so what do we do as humans? And what's our role? And I'm wondering if it's, you know, and I'm just spitballing here off the top of my head, if it's going to involve us doing a lot more human to human communication and collaboration.